Cole scores in 71, one under par in the replay. And now we see, well, do we see the final stroke? He's entertained everyone for 40 years, and this is their way of thanking him. at this fine par five. Oh. How about that for two shots? This hole measures 524 yards. Can he get an eagle? Oh. So no eagle. But a birdie, and suddenly Watson goes to 10 under par and is now in the lead. Tom Watson's second shot, 17th. Three wood. It's a long way, big carry over those bunkers that are waiting. Pin tucked away a bit today. But he's just getting that little bit of good fortune that you need. See it coming down onto the green, and he's got a chance for a three. Well, I must say, if he could hold this, could really put the cat among the pigeons. Eight under at the moment, this to go, nine under. And it's there. Nine under, 279 for young Watson. It's online, is it far enough? Oh, and what a lovely bounce. And what a great start. Look at that. Down to within three and a half, four feet at the very, very most. Must be longer than a cricket pitch. Oh, look at this judgment. Look at it. Oh, stop it. Oh, dear. dear. That would have been an absolute crunching blow to Newton if that had gone in. He's a nice smile, isn't he? Looks a boyish looking lad. Looks like something out of Tom Sawyer or Bill Brown's school days or whatever it was. He's got a nice, smiling, jolly face. Looks as if he actually enjoys it, which probably only three people in the world have ever enjoyed playing it professionally, but he looks like one of them. Three. Both one under par. Each got a four for 71. And he's going to put it. All according to the rules for stroke play, this is. Just get this in. It's all on the last putt. Well done, Watson. Four. Coles, of course, in 71, one under par in the replay. And now we see, well, do we see the final stroke or don't we? John Carmichael, the captain of the Royal Nation, presents the winner of the 1975 Open Championship, Tom Watson, with his cheque and this wonderful trophy that bears so many great names in golf.
won this tournament five times, but I think he's given this championship more than it's given him. It doesn't matter how he finished, it's how he played over the years. And at Carnoustie, Turnbury, Muirfield, Trin, Birkdale he won, and at St Andrews he finishes. One of the greatest Open champions of all time. He's entertained everyone for 40 years, and this is their way of thanking him.